All right, my friends, welcome to a new video on my channel. I'm Alan, 27 years young from Germany, and today I have a delicious and special plan because it's the second day of January. So I wish you all first an amazing and happy new year. And I want to celebrate the new year with a lot of German bakery goodies because I'm super in love with German bakery stuff. And my plan today is a little bit different. I want to go to a traditional German bakery, but as well to some supermarket bakeries because at the moment we got a lot of amazing stuff in the supermarket bakeries I have to say so I will go to Penny, I will go to Edeka, I will go to Aldi and I will go to Lidl and I will buy me a lot of delicious stuff from every single supermarket and bakery and then we will see us at the table with a lot of delicious food so stay tuned it's going to be a delicious bakery cheat day challenge and I cannot wait to try I'm super hungry right now I'm I'm still fasted and I was super active today so Yes, it's time to dig in into some delicious foods guys, so stay tuned. Son of a dough, this is going to be epic. Okay guys, everything is presentable right now in front of me. We got over 23 items, I think, of bakery goodies. And I cannot wait to try at all. It smells so delicious, but before we start, it's not healthy guys, it's just more for entertainment, so don't do this at home. You can have cheat days, but you don't have to go so crazy like me right now, because yes, it's nothing about health and fitness at this point, but I'm in love with bakery goodies. I really don't care that much about myself at the moment, I have to say, I train a lot and I try to balance it out as much as I can but so it's time for a delicious German bakery feast and I hope you will appreciate all the money that I spent and yeah I hope you will like the foods and let me know please what is your favorite item till the end and yeah if you're new don't forget to subscribe to my channel I got a lot of different and amazing cheat days I get I think that you really have to see and yeah so that was all, now it's time to start. So, and right now it's 7.24 in the night, 2nd of January. Let's start simple with the simple chocolate glazed donut from Lidl. They are super cheap, but to be honest, they are really not bad. So for 60 cents, why not? Cheers guys, first bite of the day. Ah, and yes, I think I have to get some amazing donuts again. It's been a long time since I've had the last real donut cheat day. But yeah, guys, love you all. Cheers and much love from Germany. Simple, but soft texture. I love the dough. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah. So many sweet items, oh wow. It's from the Edeka Bakery, a croissant, with some hazelnut bits on top. And it's filled, but I got no idea what's inside. Maybe chocolate, hazelnut cream, I got no idea. Yeah, it looks like hazelnut cream. Flaky, buttery, let's see. Mmm, like Nutella. I can Nutella filled croissant. Mmm, wow. That is super good. So, in here we got the Berliner, guys. It's like a donut, you can say, but fluffier. And this is filled with, I think, a strawberry. Jam and it's from the traditional German bakery. Really super pillowy. Oh, and you can smell the yeast. I love it. Mmm. But Germans are often really shy with the filling. So far no filling. It's like plum. I like it. Oh, the texture is so amazing from the bakery, wow! Super moist, I love it! 
Sometimes they're super dry. Mm. It's a plum filling. Sometimes they're super dry, but this is so moist. Oh wow. Mm. Now let's switch up to something that is savory. This is also from Edeka. It's a pretzel stick with a lot of cheese. I love pretzel bread. Mmm. It's nothing special, but it's still delicious. Now it's time for the Streuseltaler. Greetings to you again, Darko. I get this only for you, but I got also a different one that I never saw before. And it's covered with a lot of sugar icing and a lot of cake crumbles on top. It's super delicious. Mm. Mm. Buttery, sugary, flaky. Perfect. Now, time for something that is savory again. Here we got a, it's like a puff pastry, it calls a burek, so a Turkish style cigarro, you can say, and it's filled with spinach and feta cheese. And I get this from Lidl. So in a, in a traditional German bakery, you will never see this, but in supermarket, in German supermarket bakeries, you can get this almost almost everywhere but the little bones never let you down mmm <laughs> they taste really traditional mmm this is also from Itika a savory item it's a pizza donut it's a pizza margarita shaped donut. <laughs> Let's see if this will be good. I got no idea. Mm. The sauce is not on point. The dough. It's a little bit too doughy. It's not bad. But. What we do here is go back, 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 back. First just a half. It's nothing special, but great idea. Next the croissant from Lidl, and it's filled also with chocolate and some chocolate bits and powdered sugar on top. Oh yeah, there we go. Better than the first one. Wow. This chocolate flavor is different. I prefer this so much more. Mmm. Wow. Wow. That was delicious. No joke. Now let's try out this baby boy. And I think this is filled with custard, some elements on top. Looks like a Danish pastry. Yeah. Bean Bienenstich Plunder? I got no idea. But let's try it out. Mmm. Oh wow. The castle is amazing. Strictly in a little bit cold. But the outside is super crispy. Because of the burnt almonds. Mmm. Oh wow. And now it's time for some fruits, guys. Here we got a little apple pie. And I love this. Tastes exactly like a McDonald's apple pie. All the cinnamon. Mmm. Flaky pastry. 
and the filling is on point. Just look at it. Thing, this bad boy here, it's a kind of a bread and it's filled with sweet potato and feta cheese. It's from a traditional German bakery and I never saw this before. And also some seeds on top. I never try it. I hope this is good, I got no idea. Yeah, you can see the sweet potato and the feta cheese. Wow. Wow. I never had something like that before. But this is good. Mmm. And this is a quark touch. It's like a croissant pastry flaky dough and it's filled with a lot of quark but fatty quark not your healthy one and a lot of sugar in the quark as well vanilla sugar and it's really really good it's it's so simple but it's so tasty it's like a sweet vanilla -y and milky cream. Mmm. I love this. Oh wow. Strictly reminds me of my childhood. Mm. So a delicious chocolate muffin from a German bakery right now with some nuts and caramel sauce. Mm. Yeah. It also got chocolate chunks in the dough. Also caramel sauce in the inside of the muffin. This is going to be a delicious bite. Oh yeah. This is what we're talking about. Mmm. This is the best part right now. Oh wow. Right now I love it. <laughs> mm -hmm. Oh. Mm. This is so good. It's more like a dulce de leche cream than caramel. And here we got a hefty cookie. It's really super heavy from Aldi. It's a white chocolate macadamia. And these are my favorite ones. I love white chocolate macadamia cookies. Super high in calories, but they worth really every single calorie. Oh. Aldi, no joke. We got not the biggest variety. But a delicious one. Mmm. 9 out of a 10. Oh. Now it's time for something that is savory again from Lidl, and this is a chicken hot dog with jalapeno and cheese. Jalapenos, some sauce ketchup or something, roasted onions and a lot of cheese. Yeah, it's okay. It's nothing that is so special. Work of art, definitely. This poppy seed beauty from a German bakery Oh wow, okay, no. Right, oh, it's right now the poppy seed flavor comes. And I love poppy seeds. And the glaze is perfect. Mmm. Oh yeah. 
Look at this beauty, no joke. Amazing. <laughs> so now let's try out this smaller Berliner. But this is from Lidl and I never tried a <coughs> oh, vanilla custard cream filled one. Berliner, never. First time that I saw this and I got to try it out, so let's see. Oh wow. Mmm. Damn, it's loaded everywhere with the custard. Lidl, damn. Today you are really my favorite, I think. Mmm. I gotta say, this. Berliner from the Lidl bakery was better than from the traditional German bakery. Wow, it's a marzipan cream filled croissant. And guys, when you know me, I love marzipan really a lot. And this one is proper filled with delicious marzipan cream. No. Mm -hmm. Strictly. Mm. This is from the Edeka bakery and they call this the kebab because it's filled I think with kebab meat. Yeah, chicken kebab meat. Oh wow, a lot of cheese, paprika and and you can see the filling. Try this out. Damn! They nailed the kebab flavor. Mmm! And with the cheese. Mmm! This is really, really, really good. Oh wow! This is how we do
is gone. Only this is left. No, it's not for me. Something is on the pizza that I really don't like. Ah. Okay, guys. That was all from the German bakery feast. Oh, but it was delicious. I gotta say that was the perfect way to start the new year with an amazing bakery feast from Germany. I hope you liked the video. Please let me know what was your favorite item. Right now it's time to relax a bit. Definitely I will take a long walk or something and then I think I will hit the gym again. Because today's Thursday and on Sunday I got a new cheat day that I want to record. <laughs> So stay tuned for that, watch my other videos, and yeah, happy new year guys. <sighs> oh, I'm so full. So guys, take care, goodbye, we see us.